Greetings, welcome. We're going to do the Great Bay Spider House today because that's the only way we're going to be able to get stay up all night mass. And we got to get rid of like 30 school tools that are all located in this house somewhere. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well then. Then, let's get this one here. There's our first two. Alright. So now. Oh. Good thing we have a hook shot. Alright, now. Oh, wait a minute. Let me down. Hey! <laughs> 
There's 30 of them. Twenty to go. I guess this one is easily missed, but not by me. I'll just keep hearing her crawling. This area is clear. Here we go. Sir, it's been a long time since we've seen you. As you've ordered, sir, we are investigating the secrets of this place. According to the information I have obtained, it seems a heart should be a heart should be shot six. Yes. Whatever that means. Aha, I see you up there. Oops. 
Speed should be shot first. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. So let's see. Speed one. Okay. When I get other clues. Aha. Hiding, but it could not. Hear it, it must still be here. Uh -huh. Long time as you ordered the secret place. It seems heart should be shot second. Heart. Yes. Oh, 
but it must be Schools, now the curse can be lifted. But, so first would be so speed, then heart, then club, then diamond, then club. Or is that not the right one? that I was meant to see. I want that big wallet now. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can leave this place. Check it out. This place is so smart for our children. Did you find this place? I beg you, let me have this place. Not for free, of course. I hope this will do. Giant wallet. I can hold up to 500 rupees. Hmm. 
<laughs> All right, so what we're going to do next is then we're going to equip it right to here. And play the song of time. So now that we have the Up All Night Mask, we might as well take advantage. Okay. We'll take advantage of having the mask and we'll just add this little bit of extra in. only feature that the Up All Night Mask does. Oh, oh a tortoise, did you finish helping father? And let mother read you a story. Okay, the Carnival of Time. We'll read this one first. So it's here, so it's good for you to learn its meaning. It's a little long, but I'll read it with some enthusiasm. The Carnival of Time, each year, the season of harmony begins when the sun and the moon are in alignment. Paying homage to the way that both nature and time tirelessly in the process of progressing. The Carnival of Time is when the peoples of the four worlds celebrate that harmony and request fruitfulness for the year. Ooh. For ages, people have worn masks resembling the giants who are gods of the four worlds. Now, it has become a custom for each person to bring a handmade mask to the Carnival of Time. Hey, that's Oddwalla's mask up there, isn't it? Okay. It is said that if a couple unites on the day of the festival and dedicates a mask as a sign of their union, it will bring luck. The centerpiece of the carnival is the clock tower. On the eve of all the festivities, the door to its roof is opened. From atop the clock tower roof, a ceremony to call the gods is held, and an ancient song is sung. All of these festivities for the carnival of time are held so that we may ask the gods for a rich harvest in the year to come. You did a good job, that's all for Tortoise. Now when the clock tower roof opens, now when to, uh, on the eve of the festival. Oh cool, okay. Okay. But. Yes. The Four Giants. The Four Giants, is it? This is quite long, but it is a good story for you to hear, so I'll read it with some extra gusto. Ahem. The Four Giants. This tales from long ago when all the people were separated into four worlds like they are now. In those times, all the people lived together, and the Four Giants lived among them. On the day of the festival that celebrates the harvest, the Giants spoke to the people. We have chosen to guard the people while we sleep, 100 steps north, 100 steps south, 100 steps east, and 100 steps west. Should you ever have need of us, should the mountain blizzard trap you, or the ocean swallow you up, call out to us, loud and clear. We shall hear your cry. Now then, there was one who was shocked and saddened by all this, a little imp. Imp was a friend of the giants since before they had created the four worlds. Why must you leave? Why do you not stay? 
The childhood friend felt neglected, so he spread his anger across the four worlds. Repeatedly, he wronged all the people there. Overwhelmed with misfortune, the people sang the song of prayer to the giants who lived in each of the four compass directions. The giants heard their cry and responded with a roar. O Imp, O Imp, we are the protectors of the people. You have caused the people pain. O Imp, leave these four worlds, otherwise we shall tear you apart. The Imp was frightened and saddened he had lost his old friends. The Imp returned to the heavens and harmony was restored to the four worlds. And the people rejoiced, and they worshipped the giants of the four worlds like gods, and they lived happily ever after. Ooh. Good job! Wasn't that fun, Tortoise? What did the people do to call the giants? Sing a song. That's right! You couldn't have just sing that song anywhere. Okay. The spot at which those giants parted is right in the middle of this very town. Okay. And on that, finally done this episode. I messed up a couple times. So, <laughs> so, on that note, be sure to hit the links below to follow me on social media. Be sure to give this episode a like. Be subscribe and check out my other videos in the right hand column. And until next time, I point to my right, that will be in your left right hand column. Until next time, later taters.